Welcome back. Please help me welcome Shane Corson, our co-host for the day, but he's here in another capacity. He's going to tell us about the United States Armed Forces Veterans Motorcycle Association. It's a mouthful, huh? Otherwise, what all these letters, U-S-A-F-V-M-A. You got it. <laughs> I That's got right. it. <laughs> and, and the more you say that, the quicker you get. U-S-A-F-V-M-A. I've got it down now. Yeah, I'd add a few extra letters in there. Yeah. So anyhow, Shane, I'm looking at this vest that you have on. It's very intriguing. I see a few different things on there. What's this geek thing? <laughs> <laughs> geek is my road name. Oh, actually. okay. Uh, what does that mean? Um, well, you know me as far as my, my business is concerned. Let's talk graphics, website oh, design, development, I got it. I got computer it. IT, repair, etc. It. Et it all goes together. Okay. Yeah, I am, and I've said this on the show before, the quintessential computer geek. Computer geek. So you just shorten that to geek. Yeah. That's yep. appropriate for you. And then I see this other one, Nevada, the Battleborn State. Not right. a lot of people know that. Right. That's one of one of the things that Nevada is known for. Well, mm -hmm. tell us a little bit about this motorcycle club. Is it for veterans? Is I mean that's the name of it. So right, right. I would assume. Yep. It's um, and to just to clarify, to begin with, it's uh, not a motorcycle club. Oh, okay. uh, we have to be kind of careful about how we how we present ourselves. Right, right. It's actually an association. Um, oh, now what's the difference? Um, there are differences between uh, if well, like a motorcycle club, uh, there are certain processes that a member or a prospect would have to go through in order to become a member. Right. Um, like an initiation type thing? There's, yeah, it, it really depends on the club, but oh, okay. yeah, there could be an initiation. Ah. And, you know, even for our association, there's a bit of an initiation, which I can talk about here in a minute. But okay. motorcycle clubs, um, the biggest difference is, is that when you're in a motorcycle club, you earn your patch. Uh, you flat out earn it. You have to earn it. Oh. It's not given away. Oh. And now, it's what, not what something do you mean patch? You you're not talking about these patches. You're... Are you? There's a back patch on oh, here, and I think okay. we, we okay. shot it, pre-shot it. So uh, that patch, there's top and bottom rockers and, and the center seal patch, and that's all very, very unique to a motorcycle club. Right. And they look at that as being you know, very, very important to them. Wow. So difference between our association and a motorcycle club is, and also vets versus non-vets, uh, it's an association. It's uh, USAF VMA is a subsidiary of HomelandHeroes.org, oh, which right. is a 501c3 okay. right. okay. corporation. Right. Mm -hmm. And what we are here to do is support the, uh, the, the functions and the affairs of veterans of foreign wars of VFW. Right, okay. And also we're here to support other clubs that are supporting those functions and affairs as well. Well, I have to talk to you about a, an event that we're doing coming up in November, so you guys might be interested. Absolutely. Are you going to be in the Fall Festival Parade? I, I am not, personally, no. But, and I'm not sure if Bob Pilkington, the chapter president, is. Right. He might be, but if that's the case, he'd probably be there for his other business, oh, right. which is my paralegal. But you'll be walking around at the festival in your vests, won't you? Ah, uh, we'll see what the weekend brings. Okay, good. Yeah. So, you know, I was looking at your uh, Facebook page, and I noticed, and I, I kind of smelled strawberries. <laughs> <laughs> I noticed yeah. there was something about champagne, strawberries, and the whipped cream. Uh, would you like to elaborate on that? Yeah, sure. It isn't exactly what it sounds like, It's not what you, so it isn't what you think. So it is family-oriented, right? Yes, okay. yes. Oh, yes, yes. <laughs> vets and non-vets, and, and uh, like I have my son, you oh, know, okay. and there's other, okay. other, other uh, people there with, with kids and women. We have a couple of... Oh, so uh, we're okay. Absolutely, okay, absolutely. Good. Okay, so what's the deal with the, uh, the Facebook page? Um, remember that initiation that we, yes, we spoke about? Yes, yes. I thought that was coming. <laughs> yeah. Well, they sent me on a little mission, they being the other, uh, the other patched members. I had to earn my patch still. And, you know, beyond uh, getting their website done, beyond talking about the association right. on, the, uh, you know, on TV and trying to plug raffle tickets and, right. and the first event coming up, um, they wanted me to earn, you know, do a little bit more earning. So this weekend at, in Crystal, um, at uh, Short Branch Saloon, there was a huge motorcycle rally, right. Bordello Run, Did see that. Okay. going on. And probably about 400 people there. Wow. Bob calls me over and says, Shane, I've got a mission for you. Uh-oh. He hands me this piece of paper. 
and I read it, and of course it's all very self-explanatory, and what this paper, piece of paper says is, hi, I'm trying to earn my patch today. I'm not allowed to speak. So, <laughs> have you seen my, and then there's a picture of, of a patch here. So I had to walk around. I didn't know there was somebody in the crowd of this three or 400 oh. people that had this patch. Oh. I had to walk around, and I couldn't say a word. Just show the paper. And just show the Wouldn't paper. Wouldn't it have been funny if the first person you went up to had the patch? As a matter of fact, <laughs> as a matter of fact, uh -oh. the very first person that I walked up to, the guy standing next to him, had the patch. Had the patch. Oh, so I got back. You got lucky. Uh, no, oh, okay. no. I'll get there still. That was um, too easy. It was. It was literally too easy. So I brought, the, I brought it back to Bob within five minutes. He told me to go Las Vegas or somewhere. He told me to go somewhere. Um, and uh, they spoke about it for a couple of minutes and said, no, you know, that's just too easy. Um, we're going to give the patch to somebody else and, oh, okay. uh, and you're going to do it again. So. so this time you had to go through all 400. I went through probably about 200 people and then... Um, and then I had the bright idea of, well, there's a, there's a band up on stage playing. I'm not allowed to speak, but if I took this paper up oh, there... quick thinking. It was accidental, actually. Oh, okay. People were giving me okay. hints at one point saying, right. go over there, go over there. So I got up on, on the stage, and it just worked out. So I didn't say anything, but uh, the guy in the mic did. Oh, and someone came running up with the patch? Within, within a couple of minutes, oh, I had the patch. so you earned your patch. Yes, oh. I earned it. I am well, very happy. Well, we're so happy. proud of you Thank for you. earning your patch. <laughs> it's a fun thing. It, it really it, is, is just it? a fun thing. So now, how many of you get together and go on these rides just from local here? Uh, right now, we have a core group, I think, of about 16, somewhere between 15 and 20 people. We uh, met some more people over the weekend. So uh, Wonderful. Yeah. So now you do these poker runs, right? That's right. Our and first that run. is all to earn money. Now, and what right. do you do with the funds? The funds actually, well, it, it splits. What we're doing is we're doing a poker run or, you know, a ride. It's right. the first annual ride for the VFW Food Bank. Okay. So okay. we're selling raffle tickets. There will be a 50-50. You yeah, know, there will be the poker run. There will be people there, um, you know, selling food. And the money that comes in, part of the money that comes right. in, is actually going to go to the VFW Food Bank so oh, that okay. they can supply... Uh, you know, replenish their supplies. Right. Okay, this is Saturday, October 13th that mm -hmm. you're actually doing this ride. Right. And where it start? Where does it start? We all start at Mountain Springs Saloon at the top of the mountain okay, here between okay, here and Las Vegas. Okay, know where that is? Right yep. at the top of the hill. Yep. And we'll ride. We have four, uh, four stops. The last stop being uh, we'll end up in Crystal. Okay. At Short Branch Saloon. So, and you're gonna, we're gonna have like 400 riders coming through Pahrump on October 13th. I hope we can be that successful. It would be fantastic. If, it would yeah. be. Yeah. Wow. And if you don't ride, you know, even if you don't ride, you're still welcome to come. Drive, drive your car, and regardless, it'll be a good time. Just what do you do? Just find out where the different stops are. Yeah, we'll have the map. Uh, where everybody, uh, you know, people will know where to go. And you just stop at these different places. You pick up a, a card, a poker right. card, and at the end you have five cards. The best hand wins the, oh, right. uh, the okay. poker run. Oh, okay. Now, do you have regular weekly or monthly meetings? Um, it's the, uh, the organization is still really young. Yes, we do meet okay. up. Uh, we have a, a meeting place set aside for us in Beatty. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah. Now, do you get together? Is this like Nye County type thing or...? Is it? It's not just Pahrump. Obviously, no, it's not just Pahrump. Obviously, you're going to Beatty Pahrump. for a meeting. Yeah, we have people that live in Pahrump here, uh, members that live in Pahrump, members that live in Beatty. Hopefully, we'll be able to attract some people from Las Vegas. Oh, wow. So it'll be a statewide type of event eventually. Yeah. Um, association. Statewide, hopefully national. You know, there right. may be enough interest in this where other charters in other states can, can form. And Wow. Sounds like a great, sounds like a fun association to belong to also. Yeah. Again, where can people get in touch with you or someone to if they're interested in joining sure uh, right now the uh, the website is probably the best way to find out more about us and that is going to be uh, at homelandheroes.org h-o-m-e-l-a-n-d-h-e-r-o-e-s dot o-r-g 
and you'll see the uh, the uh, button to go to USAF VMA from, oh, okay. from that okay. website. And you don't have to be a geek to do this, right? No, absolutely <laughs> not. Okay, well, thanks, Shane, and I will see you shortly. We will be right back. Thanks, Terry.